What it do, Ski? It's your boy, Farewell34, and today I'm here with my Attack on Titan Season 1, Episode 2 reaction video. How's it going, people? If you're here early, you might be one of my patrons, so I want to give a huge shout out to every single one of y'all for joining, and shout out to all of the new people as well. If you're here, that means you might be wanting to watch these Attack on Titan videos in advance, plus the unedited raw reaction. So, yeah, we're going to be on Episode 2. So, last episode, we were introduced to this world with these things called Titans. They are these giant and some mega giant creatures. Don't really know much about them. Um, we had we were introduced to our, I think, our main characters, which are Aaron and who I call Tails. <laughs> um, give me a little couple episodes. Give me a couple episodes to learn everyone's names. I don't know if it's one of those shows who have like a billion characters or anything, but I always need a couple episodes to get used to it. Yeah, that was the episode. Um, really cool. I like the I like the vibe. It was like it's sort of like medievalish or whatever. Animation style is really cool. Music was fairly hype. Interesting premiere pilot, I'd say. So let's just dive on episode two. Anyway, as always, if you enjoyed this one, then be sure to leave a hot like and subscribe if you haven't already. With that being said, let's get this one going. Yeet. Oh, is this after that first event? Or... Ooh. I was hoping it's actually got a hybrid. Dead. Oh, we're picking up right after, eh? This guy's out here preaching. I'd be, I'd be running, dog. These things are so weird. So are they like mutated humans? Are they just like... Not aliens. I don't know. What's up, baby girl? How you doing? Oh! She is. She got squished like a grape, certainly. Hey, man. You know where the bathroom is? <laughs> so, do they live only to kill humans? Or, like, do some of them have, like, hobbies and, like, a job? Or... Oh, he's gonna hate the system now. You're putting this on him? You take some onus, bro. Okay. At least he wasn't saying, you know, everything was my in your fault. He's, he's acknowledging his mistake. He's a bitch ass, head ass. What's Tail saying, though? Oh, so they showed all those walls. So is this the, like the most outer wall that's been compromised? Oh, okay. So is this the only place? Like, is this the last of humanity? Like, is this in this wall? In the, these three walls? Really? Are there no other, like, continents, countries and shit, or? What's Gucci? Damn, they just left all their shit, huh? No one could bring anything, not even a user. Armin, that's, that's the name. I don't know why that's still in my mind. Oh, I find it hilarious how just casual a lot of these titans look. <laughs> Everything's so intense in this show. Oh my gosh. Yui! Yui! One of them just like freaking eats their child. <laughs> Dude, they are not prepared at all. Look, none of them, all of them have those freaking, like, fruit ninja, you know, swords on their sides, but none of them are using it. Yeah, okay, they don't have, like, a military they can go, like, like, a higher military? Because I thought that was it, dude, but it's not. See, at least when he cries, he's not as much of a bitch as Deku. Like, I love My Hero Academia. Deku's one of my favorite characters, like, of all time. But, recalling back to season one, this guy was the biggest bitch. Oh, my God. <laughs> Look, Aaron's getting that conviction, boy. To miss me with that shit, Tails. <laughs> but, damn, that one linebacker, whatever, that one, that one was running fast as hell. 
10,000? Yeah, where were you at, dog? Hey, our means a plug. Uh -oh. So from my assessment, Aaron uh, is a smoke giver. He takes no shit. Dog, okay, let's just let's be a little realistic here. I understand you're upset, Aaron. You want to go back where all the Titans just broke in? You don't have any of those ninja slicing tools. All you got is a loaf of bread. And if you go, you'll be dead. Oh, she gave him the smoke! She really just gave the man a death of like that, bro. Facts. In this circumstance, whatever it is, you can't just leisure around and shit and like, I don't know. Make fires and roll for brewskis or something. It's kind of awkward, by the way. That's dead ass, though. Like, at this point, you have no family. All you got are your friends now. Gotta survive. This is interesting. So they're, like, skipping a lot of time sporadically. So they're giving all the, the conviction for for him to become, for all of them, I guess, to become Titan Slayers. This is actually a pretty good setup to that. Because if they had just started off the series with that, it wouldn't have been as impactful. You don't understand why they want to do that. But now we got conviction, understanding, so we can slice and dice. I had the misfortune. <laughs> Will you still be food? This is a motivational speech. That was Attack on Titan Season 1, Episode 2. That was my reaction video, y'all. Yo, pretty good episode. That was Part 2. I was going to say, it wasn't like a completely separate episode. I think it was a Part 1 and Part 2 of the premiere. Pretty solid. Like I said, it establishes this world even further. Now there's a food shortage, and they're trying to regain the territories. You understand a little bit more of the inner circles, which is pretty cool. And now we have the conviction for all of our characters, Armin and Eren, to why they want to fight Titans. All they have is she established like dude like all we got to do now is just survive and eat and aaron's on his tip where he's like dog i'm finna kill all of them you with me or what so now i think they're gonna be a unit them three best friends and just murder titans and um so they're all enrolled now so it's gonna be interesting to see if they do like a training montage or if they're gonna jump straight to them just fighting titans so that should be pretty dope to see and yeah overall i'm enjoying the show so far i imagine it's gonna get hyper uh more hype and emotional as things go on um and i'm starting to really feel a little bit for those two characters um with their with their parents being 
families are gone and they only have each other to fend for. So it's going to be pretty interesting to see how this goes. But anyway, y'all, that's going to wrap it up for this video. As always, if you enjoyed it, then be sure to leave a hot like and subscribe if you haven't already. Again, if you want to get early access to these videos, then definitely be sure to check out patreon.com slash 34 in the description down below. Anyway, though, with that being said, I'll see you next time, y'all. Peace.